my studio. Alright, na tivo to see potezi wakati. Barabuja tunakutana na Udo. Yeah, Udo ni kadhalika remember sasa amekusha kukuwa ni mwenyeji kule Ushago. Um, Udo uh-huh. ameishi na ndugu yake kwa muda wa karibia miaka tatu sasa. Na amekusha pata marafiki. Marafiki wake ni kama hawa kina Nyaleru. Kuna mzee fulani anaitwa Nyaleru. Ni huyu. Ni mzee ambaye bila shaka amekaa tauni na mambo ya kunywa pombe ndio yake sana. Najua kule ushago. Ala sasa anapeana story vali ambako wanaenda mapate pombe na kutakuwa na mziki. You are joking. Eh. Ni wapi uko? Stage 2. Stage 2. Haki ya lali watakunywa busa na kwa hivyo anamwambia hapa ajiandae. Sasa hawa ndio marafiki ambao already Edo ameanza kupata huko nyumbani. It's okay. It's okay. Imagine. No I'm going to see you later. Of course. Okay now. One. I will see you later. Lazima tupange kama vile ambavyo tutakuja kuenea. <laughs> Lazima tujulikane kwa kijiji hii kwamba sisi ndio wenye we. Oh. Mare dadi zaidi. <laughs> Imagine bado anaishi na ndugu yake. Sasa inafika wakati ambako Hawezi yoshewa nguo, yeye ndiye anajioshea. Na mahali pa kuandika nguo ni inakuwa mahali moja. Si amekuja amepata mavazi ambayo ilikuwa imeoshwa, iko kwa kamba na ijakauka. Yeye anakuja anasema waze wewe wewe wewe. Jana mliandika, leo ni mimi naandika. Sasa angalia. Ujawaiona, ujawaiona aibu. <laughs> Aujawaiona aibu ya mwanaume mzima kuleteana na wamama wenye wanaanika nguo. Wewe umejua juzi si kuoga. Juzi kutu asijasafisha nguo. Hamwezi nisafisia na nyinyi hata kamba. Udoye. Udoye. My name continue. Udoye. No keep singing. Ole lo yaye. Hakenani bibi ya ndugu ye. Aliona shida nyingi zaidi. God in heaven. Simeo, Udoye live us alone. I don't have anything here. Have, you don't have anything. I don't listen to you. If you don't have anything. Oh. Udoye. Damn. No, God. Udo ya anabia, anabia bibi ya ndugu ya Wewe auna kitu huko juu Mina juu ile kitu huko nayo hiko chini Chasa hindi kuambia mutu nini Auna kitu juu Huko la kitu chini Makosa sana hii You have not allowed me and my family You have not allowed me to Umesaidiwa, umepatiwa mpaka pali ya kuishi Umepatiwa mali ya kulala Unapatiwa chakula udo We bado unaletana Mambo kidogo kama hii ya kuosha nguo na kuandika nguo Wewe unasema ati Ati watoe nguo zao sasa Udo ya anike zake Hai ni tabi ya mbae Sasa inibidi mama na ye kwa sababu ni mama hata ye Anasire Tutajua Nani ya taanika Kwa hizi zako Ama songesa huko Nazima zangu zenye zititangulia Dio zika uke kwanza Ayaye Udo na ya kasitua Unangangane ni Kupe sasa dio sasa Kama ni karate haki ya nani walai leo tunapigana Kama ni karate tunawana Mama uchechi kamu Kamu Mama uchechi kamu na hindi alatoroka Kamu Haki ya nani walai kamu Kamu Vile nilionye saka musambadi I will show you I will, I will show you Oka ba Sasa, hui ni mwanaume kwe Kuonyesha wana, kuonyesha wana wake ngumi Kusema kweli Ni unguwana Tabi ambaya hii Who do you is? Imebe nisibia Kamu, kamu, kamu ujue Kamu Kamu Don't touch my clothes Don't touch them You're not there anything Don't touch my clothes Usikuze nguo zangu wewe Usikuze nguo I live there hii ni tabia gani? Usikuze kwe Ala musukuma na maputi yo Pala guzungu Pala guzungu Na kumbe bati njema ndi wakati Amba koricha ndugu yake alikuwa na kuja So you can't give me respect In this house Uda What is the matter with you? Uda bebe ni nani? Who are you? What do you have to say? Okay, instead of you to ask me what is happening right now. Wewe bini ndugu yako kuliko uniulize nani ananiaragiza. Wewe unaanza kuuliza hapa bibi yako. Bibi yako mimi na yeye nani nani alizaliwa hapa? Ndoe leme huyo wewe. Look at what your wife. Wewe ujui bibi ulitoa huko. I came back from Ugoloka tell your wife has been maltreating me. Nani mkubwa hapa? Not to here to kill the force. 
Sasa ndio sasa sasa ndio baadaye yenyewe bora tayari angalia kaona yenyewe ikifika ni vita mimi najua mimi najua udo ulichapa watu wengi ukasema uliua watu watatu Nairobi Uliua watu watatu Nairobi eh na mimi sitaki mambo ya vita Lakini kwa nini unaletana juu na bibi yangu Eh eh udo udo akaanza kujigamba na hiyo hiyo yenye ameona ndugu yake aliamini ati aliua watu watatu Nairobi Sasa ile kitu iko Buda I... Bibi yako ni kama bibi yangu Sisi uke mbafo So lakini Richard na mwambia mazi apana Wewe ulikuja hapa Hapa uja jenga Hii ni kuangu kwa nyumba Bibi yangu ndiyo mwenye hii nyumba Ni lazima umpatie shima Let me tell you and most importantly I want you to get the wife No I love the other side So Richard alimonyesha Ikiwa unataka kuishi na mna hii Na wewe ni ndugu yangu wala siwezi ni kukufukuza Na hapa ni kwetu tuliwachiwa na wazazi wetu After I came back from Richard yenye walikuwa na nia plani. Alikuwa na plana akamwambia Lazima nitakutafutia bibi. Bombing issues. You know, bombing here killing people, bombing my shops. Was not only one shop. Right now as it is I have to, you know, be plain to you. I don't have a, a, a capital. And also that side getting a wife is not like getting a girlfriend. So I need a good capital, you know, to start me. Sasa akaanza kumpatia vikwazo. Udo sasa anapeana kwa ke Richard vikwazo. E, nimesikia unasema ndio ni vizuri, unataka kunipatia bibi. Na unajua si raisi kuletea mutu bibi. Lazimu ulete bibi mwenye ako comfortable. Bibi ambaye ukiona ako na figure 8. Sasa ananza kupea la vikwazo. E, Buda, Amin. kuna wanawake wengi hapa ushago unaizaishi nae. Na uwanze kazi ya kulima. E, Aliposikia mambo ya kulima chamba aliamuka. I have seen where... I have seen where this your your lecture is. Richard ni mwanza kuona mali unaelekea. Unataka kunifanya mimi nikuwe mfanye kazi yako eh? Ni mimi mtu mzima niko na akili timamu niishike jembe niende kulima. Mimi. Nifanane na kina Andrew ambaye wamezoea kulima. Hapa uchagu. Ambejuna. Stop selling. Sasa tafadhali nirudi Nairobi ni uwawe kuumalishwa. Kuliko kulima samba. Million. 2 million. Kuliko unitafutia 2 million ni Fungue biashara hapa Nairobi. Nifungue biashara hapa ushago. Oh. No, eh, ati anasema apatiwe 2 million. Afungue video show ushago. <laughs> udo, udo ni mwenye taabu. Richard alajaribu mazi, anamwambia nitakuletea bibi ukale. Bas, sasa ilifika pale ambako iliona hawezi endelea kuishi akitegemea ndugu yake. Si alikuja ushago bado akaitwa na mama fulani apatiwe kibarua. Kibarua mahali anapatiwa mzee anaonyeshwa. Unaona hii shamba eh? Huko kutoka huko chini kabisa huko. Eh huko mtoni eh paka hapa juu eh kofiaka. Pesa ngapi? Have to pay me uh, 10000 naira. Eh? 10000 naira. Yes. 10000 naira utolewe wapi? Kawaja. Wewe kwani unafikiria hapa ni nyeri? Hapa si nyeri. 10000 naira. 10000 naira mtu apatiwe 10000 kwa kofiaka nyasi. <laughs> Na yuka. Kwa ni wewe? Na give you my actual uh, uh, price. Udo, Udo sasa asha kuwa mtu wa ushago sasa. Sasa ni kulima imebidi kupaja vibarua za kofia kanyazi huko kule mashambani. Why didn't you come with your workers? Eh? Pay me 10,000 naira. This 10,000 naira. Ta- Nyakerario kama hauta nipatia 10,000 naira, enda ulete wafanyikazi wako wakuje kukufia kia shamba. Conti- Mimi siwezi kufia kashamba yote na mnaii kwa shirigi. So that was nirifubiri. Looking at the money. You know, I'll close my eyes and uh, keep working. Nyakerario natema tampatia tuta au. Wewe ngongo. Hey. Oyana, let me pay you 2,000 naira. And also, I'll give you meals three times per day.
Yani. So, w w are you planning not to give me food before? Ah, uh, uh, plan to let you take a cola to come and get a cola ni lazima ulete mutu mwenyako kwa shamba kulima. Chakula ni lazima. You want me to clear this bush? It's not 2000. Now you must be wicked though. How can you, how can you look somebody like me do it and they are poisoning me 2000? Buddha. Edo shamba si yako na teno nanza kukombanisha mwenye shamba. Eh, kama unaona wezi enda tafuta watu wako. But don't worry, be here. Let me go there and call people that can do it. Wacha ni kutafutia watu wajwa waleza kufiaka. Watu wabaya waleza chukua 2000. Wait. Kama si 10,000, si fiaki. No fiaking. Tulipatia 2000. 2000 mutu wafi. Mutuzima kama mimi. Mutu nimepea watu uja muzito. Pregnant. Nipatiwe 2000. Mutu muzima wako lakiri timamu. 2000. Udo taabu diyo yo. Lakini miaka ilipoisha. Hakia nani miaka ilipoenda. Karibu miaka tano sasa. Watoto fulani wawili. Kuna watoto wapa. Esao na Jacobo. Haki na ukua. Waliamua kuingia reshagi. Baada ya kupatiwa map. Okay. Wakafanya uchunguzi Wakatafuta Mutu alaitua udu Na wakambiwa direction Sasa walikuja mpaka area hii Kutafuta mutu alaitua udu Watoto wawili ambao wanatuandaria picha leo hii Watoto ambao wanapenda mungu sana Watoto ambao ni waisilamu Ambaye kuswali bila shaka inakuwa gandio Duty yao kila siku you have spoken the truth. Na wakati ukumbe ni wakati alikuwa na urafiki mkubwa wake hapa ndiyo huyu. Watermelon pack. Watermelon type. Wakiwa wana kunyo mnazi. Wakunyo pombe ya mnazi yao. Can you expose such a big huge secret? Let me tell you you need it. You can chew this your kodo. Na remember wale watoto baada ya kuwa mekosha kuwasili amba wanapo ingia na mna hiyo. Waliweza kuuliza uliza ya hapa mtu wamba ya naitu wako jina Udo na wale amba walikuwa na mjua Udo moja wawo ndi huyu walikuja kumambia Udo Udo mazi kuna watoto fulani wanakutafuta wawili haya wapi wakuje wapi wakuje ala kini kwa zali ya galia kwa wana pana awa toto wanaisa kuwa metumua pegini ni pesa wana niletea pegini wana niletea pesa so hile kitu hiko goilofi wacha niende na hii anza kuwena na pombe yote ya bere hii mutu hii Hii mutu hii Hii Goirovi ya kasitwa huu mutu Akili yake nakala mulagali Aleza jena Aisuru Basi kumbe Ndiya wa sasa Watoto wa wawili katika majina kislamu Wanajita Hassan na Hussein Hassan na Hussein Na wamekuja wakitafta mutu wanaitu wako jina Udo Baada kupatiwa mapu Kutoku upanda wakule kanu Ukependa zaidi tauni Alikukua naishi hapa kuyo udo Kabla kuje kufukuzwa na wale security Wanyumba kumi Na baada ya kusikia na tafutua Alikuja nyumbani kuwanza kiuwa na asira na uliza Kwani hii ni police station Na unajua uredi tayari Alikuwa uredi asha oa Akona bibi Bibi yake Di wakati anafamishi tukua mba Unajua hawa toto Hawa toto wamekuja wakikutafuta Look at them from Look at onye nkadam Look at another person Hausa pepo, hausa pepo Sasa kawa na ungevibaya sana na uliza Watoto wanitafute mimi sura kama hii Wakuja kunitafuta mimi na wajuwaje Nani anajua hawa toto Munaizaji kukubali watu ambao ni wageni Wanakuja kunitafuta Munajuwaje kama wametumu wakuja kunilipua About you daga Akawa na asira pali tukwa mara uliza Munajuwaje wamekuja kunilipua Nini kwa kwa hii Bagu wase inaza kuwa ni kombora Wakata inaza kuwa ni bomb Inaweza kuwa ni bomb The right thing to do Ok na kiku roku Mama uchechi anasema kwani Kama ingikuwa bomb ingesha alipuka kitambo zaidi Asalamu aleku Onye na asakuwa maleku Watoto wanasema isamala aleku Maleku wasema asalamu aleku Isamala aleku We are looking for Tunatafuta Hei ujina ude ile kwa gumu kuitamuka Odoya Odo Odoya No 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 Don't worry I don't even know I can't even figure out what they are trying to pronounce Eh Doya or Diabu or Uku, whatever. My name is Udoye, not Doya. Oh, Udoye? You are yes. our Baba? You are our Baba? Ata? Yes. You are our Baba? Where is your Baba yet? Where is your Baba yet? Baba! Baba! 
mzabolo mnoto baba Bazi kumbe hawa watoto Ni watoto ambayo walikuwaga sasa Ni watoto wake Halima Kano? Halima liekuwaga ndia mepatiwa ujamzito na kujo udo Haliza watoto mapacha Kumbe hawa watoto Ni hawa walipeana ripoti Walipeana ya ni pala walipetiwa mapu Bali ambako wende kawa baba ya uyuko Mse halipo skibo ni kama lilewa Aliposikia ni Halima amewatuma na tiawa ni watoto wa Halima Udo alifurai sana alifurai sana Na juhi vila anafurai hivyo ndiyo anaongesa asira kwa bibi yake ambaya amemuwa wa juzi juzi Kwenye watoto wangu watu mbumetumu wana Halima ye mini mimi ni mimi ni mimi baba enu Baba I thought you are trying to say that I'm a native doctor you know Hey oh come my boys Welcome my boys Bagode Bagode Ali wakaribisha nyumbani Sasa jambo la kushangaza ni kwamba lazima mambo hayo Hayangi chukuli wa raisi raisi Repidi bana pale wazee wa itwe wakai chini Wajue kama ndio ikiwa kumbe ya wani watoto wake kuyo kijana wetu udo Watakishi na mnagani Walikuja tu kutaka kumujua udo ama walikuja waishi pamoja nae Na kama ni kuishi wataishi vipi jukwa ni uredi tayari Udo alikuwa shao wa mke We grew up not knowing who our father is And each time we ask our mother to tell us the whereabouts of our baba, she won't say anything. Hassani ndiyo huyu waliamuka kasema kweli vile ambavyo waliweza kutaka kumuwa na baba yao. Hata mara baada ya kuwe waliishi na mama yao kwa mdamurefu. Na wakauliza mama yao, mama, mama, tumekaa hapa na watoto wengi waga wakona baba zao. Baba yetu yuko wapi? Hassani akapiga zake flashback. You can see him. Akauliza, hivi ndivo vile tukwa tunauliza mama yetu halima. Where is our dad? Still we don't see him. Hii ni kukumbuka sasa wanakumbuka huko wakipea na story kwa ke udo pamoja na wazee wa kijiji Eti ni hivi pi walivyo muuliza ni pale halima Mpaka halima kakubali kwa pati ya mapu Na alipouriza rafiki yake kuyo udo Na ikawa wakapata mapu ya kulekea ushago Are you not happy with me your mother? Oh, mama we are happy with you But we still want to see our baba Walai we are happy Walai we are very happy Hei waliku na mbembeleza sana Mam tunafurai sana kuwa na wewe Lakini tunahamu sana ya kuwa na baba yetu Father's address If he gives it to me I promise will lie to lie I will go and look for your father And I will take you to your father Asante sana Fili tubado mama lisema Kweli nitakuenda kwa rafiki yake sana kuyo udo Nitamuliza mapu ya kuenda kwa kina udo Na nikipata bile shaka nitawapatia Na nikiwapatia mtaenda kwa mtafuta baba enu Na mtamuona life life na nimikuambia ni watoto ambayo walikuwa napenda sana kuomba kuswali kwa sababu wawa walikuwa ni waisilamu na kusema kuile walikuwa mejaliwa hata na nguhu furani zigile zinaitu wa ma extraordinary power siju kama unajuwaga unaisafikiri ni waganga na si uganga wanakuwaga na nguhu furani so kwa hivyo walipatiwa nguhu hizo na mwenyezi mungu Kadhalika kwa sababu ni watoto wanao mpenda mungu. Na kusema kweli halima aliposumbuliwa na wane watoto. Alikuja mpaka kwa moja kati ya marafiki zake udo. Ilikuwa mba kuuriza je ni wapi kuwa wanyumbani kina udo. Kwa sababu halima hakuwa najua pia ushago kwa kina udo wakati uwa. To give me the address of your brother. You mean udoye? Yes, udoye. Hapo ndi walikuja kwa Patrick Patrick alikuwa rafiki mstari wambeli wa keudo Ambaye kusema kweli atakuwa unyumbani kina kuyu Patrick likuwa gani semu hiyo Na haku wa mgumu kumpatia mapu wa ba kuyu alima Bile shaka limfamisha alima kwa unyumbani kina udo Ni uko nyamuninia I will give you the map Boje kwa moja nyamuninia Na kweli bada kupatia mapu wa alima Haka wapatia wale watoto Watoto wakaunda plani Na kweli wakapanda garele Wakapanda ni pale piki piki ika wasafirisha mpaka kwa kina udo hii ni story wala kubuka vile walipata map na story hiyo ndi wakawa na peana kule ushago ndi posa wakafika ruti hiyo naona? na wanasema wanataka kuhishi na baba yao kwa sababu watoto wegine waga wanafuraa sana wakiishi na baba yao do you have anything kaji? to mamana I promise you will not disappoint you Ugo anafali mbaba Bash Na mama kawambia sana hata mtakapo fika kule Musisa au kuomba Kumbuka nyinyi ni wa islamu Maombi ndi uwaga mambo yote Endele ni kuomba saidi She even gave us this picture 
Habash. Hata picha wanasema walipatiwa. Ati kama amuta amini ni Halima ndio huyo mama yetu kwa picha ndio huyo. Amuta anasema ndio huyo ndio huyo. Huyo ndio sasa alikuwa bibi yangu. Na wakati huo bibi yake sasa huyu mwingine lazima kasirike. Unajua huwezi tu kusema ati eh ndio huyu hii inaandika rembo. Unasema ni karembo. Watoto wako hapo na huyu bibi wa pili ako hapo. Uwaka kula u, kula uasira furani ambaye mtu wa waste furani. <laughs> My children. Alaitu Hana. Hana. Hana alikasirika. Um, welcome again my sons. What are your names? My name is Hassan and my brother's name is Hussein. Hussein. Us. Mimi ni Hassan na ndugu yangu anaitwa Hussein. Alafu jambo la kushangaza Udo wanasema yeye hapa kwao ni wa Kristo. Kwao hawananga jina kama hizo Hassan na Hussein. Na hawa watoto ni waislamu na sisi ni wakristo sisi ni traditional christians yani unaweza kunywa pombe na kesho uko kanisa ni traditional christianity so akaamua kwa badrisha jina i wish my elder brother is here to see today yeah afadhali ndugu yangu mkubwa angekuwa hai aone watoto wangu wenye nimezaa watoto chipukizi watoto wenye ngufu na unajua bana alamkasirisha ana Hana na kasiri kata na kisikia vile wanasibiwa. I what he said. From today I'm going to change your name. You no longer answer uh, give me body. Sina asaka kwa asata. Sasa nitawapatia majina ya ushago. Wewe utaitwa Rene. So usweni ko usweni. So from now you will answer Onyije. Onyije. Oyeje. Mba Oyeje means uh, who is going. Onyije means you are back. Oyeje unasema ina maanisha nani anaenda? Yes. Onyije ni wewe mwenye anakuja. You answer in uh, is how usweni ko uswefi. Amaram. So now I'm trying to change your name, you know. You will answer um, Idika. Wewe unaitwa Kidika. Eh? Uyeje na Kidika. Sasa hiyo majina wata, watakuja. Mtu akishakuwa mkubwa hivi kuchange jina ni ngumu. Ni gumu sana. So hata kama muda tuita yeye kama Idi kama ama Uyeche. Sisi ni Hassan na Hussein. Na ujue hawa ndio wanakondalia kama Esao na Jacob. Taito ya sinema. Jeje na hizo zitatokea wapi? Bado maneno. Brother Mpenzi mtazamaji siku zikawa zinayoyoma. Wale vijana wetu wakaanza kuzoea kule ushago lakini ikawa wafurahi hivyo sana. Manake Hassan anasema tafadhali warudi nyumbani. Lakini Hussein anasema hakuna kitu kama hiyo tutakaa na baba yetu. Hana naye hakuwa na furaha. Kila mara anapoona wale watoto afurahi. Eh jikwa ni hakuwa anajua ati ati huyu Edo alikuwa na bibi mwingine. Kupe ni kupeana alipeananga ujamzito na akafukusu wa tauni. So anapo una wale watoto wanafurahia zaidi na anapofurahia ndio vile anavyozidi kumkasirisha ana. Sasa jambo lingine la kushangaa ndio hii. Kumbuka mama ya watoto aliwaambia msisahau kuomba. Na ujua already baba yao ameshawabadilisha jina na amewaambia hao ni traditional Christianity. Na kwa hivyo Christianity ya old traditional yao hawakubaliki ati kuomba tena kukua waislamu. Sasa kumbe walipokuwa naendelea kuomba kiislamu hivi ndio wakati naye Udo anatoka upanda wa pili. Sasa angalia na mnajua yenyewe yenyewe acha nikwambie ukweli maombi ni maombi mradi unaomba Mwenyezi Mungu na mradi Mungu anakusikia ama anasikia maombi yako yote ni sawa yote ni sawa unamuomba Mungu na mshukuru Mungu bash lakini sasa ikawa udo anatokea upande wa pili alipo cheki akaona wale watoto wanaomba Kiislamu alisema what are you people doing in my house Emoji. You are praying Allah Kuba in my own house. Hi. Me, a full traditional Christian father from Wajai HM night. Una fanya nini? Baba. We are praying. Amara said we should always pray as directed by the Holy Prophet. Hey. Hey. You too you're supposed to follow us and pray to Allah. Boy. He's great. He's great. Allah is great. Una supposed to ungane na sisi uombe. But now what did you just call me now? Mumenitaje? Baba. If I hear that ba not to talk of the completion baba 
au baba yo he na au baba yo huru nikisikia mla niita baba wacha hiyo ba yeye mla sema niita wanyoa imama kasent murum kwa sababu pia amukeni hapo haraka iwezekana hiyo close to their door to receive an award from hamutakikani kuomba kiislamu hapa baba arune shim yu baba amekuwa mwende wazimu huyu arune osnagini mbere aro ati mnasema Maombi kwa sababu maombi ni aina mingi. Unaweza omba hata ukiwa juu ya mlima. Unaweza omba. Maombi ni maombi. Bora usitukane mtu, usiibe, usifanye dhambi. Maombi ni maombi. Na tena bora usiombe shaitani. Shaitani ndio mbaya. Sidwe. Sasa hapa ndio walikuja kwanza kushidwe. Hasa anasema afadhali turudi. Turudi tauni. Twende tukae na Halima mama yetu. Yeah, there's no good food. Hata hakuna chakula mzuri hapa. Kila siku managu. Kila siku managu. Natafadhali tuende nyumbani tutupali tunakulaga hata kuku. Walahi. Kai ya sam. We can go back to Tamu. Hassan, we have to go inside the village and know our people. Let them know us too. Eh, lakini Hussein anasema tuwezi rudi tauni. Lazima tukae hapa. Hapa ndio kwetu chago. Hapa ndio wakina baba yetu. Lazima tuzunguke tujuane na vijana wa hapa, tujuane na watoto wa hapa, tujuane na watu ya hapa. Tuwafundishe mambo ya maombi, kuswali, kutashbihi. Mambo mingi sana tufundishe hawa. Kale gani? Unaokopa nini? Hatujaka tukae. Na yenyewe wakakubaliana na Hussein. Hussein akasema watakaa. Hasa nakasema tuende nyumbani hapana turudi tao hapana tukae hapa. Sasa wakataka leo wafundishe udo lugha. Leo watafundisha udo lugha. Haya walikuja kama kawaida. Why is that you don't? Why is that you don't like us? I don't understand. Asa wewe walikuja sasa wakauliza ule mama kwa nini haupendi sisi? You don't like us. Hamutupendi. That this is our father's house. Hii nyumba ya baba yetu. Husband's house. Have you heard me? It... Na hii si nyumba ya ba... si nyumba ya Udo. Hii hapa alikuja akakaribia. Hapa ni kwa ndugu yake. Hapa si kwa baba yenu. Hapa ni kwa ndugu ya baba yenu. Nikukaribishwa tu alikaribishwa hapa. Useni sote. Leave her. Okay, wewe acha na yeye. Acha tu na yeye. Yaani yaani kakaiba hapa. Ngawaja wewe na. Ni mbaya kuiba lakini sasa juni watoi. Akachomoka aki nani na nguo asii. <laughs> Watoto wakachoboka na kwasi. Ndio walisidua kwa huyu mama mbona anatudharauaga? Mara nyingi sana uaga hatupendi. Eh hey, na walifikiri hapa ndio yuko nyumba ya baba yao. Sasa hana ilifika usiku wa manane akaamua kumuamusha hapa Udo. Lazima tuogei maneno. This is a family matter. Mimi nataka kujua. Eh hey. Huku wai niambiaga ulikuwa na bibi mwingine na mimi nime nimetosheka kuishi na watoto hapa. Afadhali warudi tauni for your information those boys you are calling those boys are my sons are you with me so stop calling them those boys if you call them those boys you look as if they are, they, they, they are from mana that came from heaven wewe wewe ukiendelea kuita watoto those boys those boys itakuwa inakali kama ni ni, ni mana ile ilitoka binguni hawa ni watoto wetu ni watoto wangu these are our children are our boys You must love them as my boys. Woman before you. Ana anaambiwa hawa ni watoto wetu na kwa hivyo lazima utawapenda. Lazima tuonyeshe furaha, lazima tuonyeshe upendo kama watoto wetu. Comfortable with them in this house. Then try to be comfortable. I said I am not comfortable with them in this house. Then I'll just if you are not comfortable. See, see, see. Wewe kama kama huko comfortable na watoto, try jaribu kukuwa comfortable. Comfortable ni rahisi. Ni wewe tu ukae ukae ko comfortable. Don't go back to my father. Ta, Joanna, ana ako la furaha yenyewe. Kila mara anapona watoto anaona bibi wa pili wa Udo. Yeye ndiye asira yake. So apendi hawa watoto. So Udo anamwambia kama uko comfortable, try and be comfortable. Ni rahisi. Kunywa chai ulale, hiyo ni comfortable. Kula ugali ulale. So that you are giving me. 
you you will cook till you get Please. tired. Don't worry, you have been giving me poison. I'll I give said you, you will cook till you get tired. Stop disturbing me. Oh. Let, you disturb me, oh. Come on, cook. Let me tell you. Ana na sema sa mina enda kwetu ushago walai uta pika chakula mpaka uchoke. You will cook until you get tired. Oh. Go. Uta pika uchoke. Bas. Adeje kusema kweli ika kwande hivyo. Kumbe wale watoto bado waliamua sasa wanatembea kijijini. Brother Mpenzi kule kijijini haikosagi vijana ambaye ni mamori mta. Haikosagi wale ambao akili yao ni mabangi. Na ujua already already wale watoto wamesema wacha watembee wakisalamiaga watu wa area, waambia hii ni kijiji yetu, nini marafiki zetu. Na kumbe hawa wanasubiri watu ambao wanaweza kuwachokosa. Haki ya nani kina Hassan na Hussein chungeni sana. Wewe wewe kuna mbili kimo zinakuja. Kuna wewe mbili kimo kujeni hapa. Hawa ni vijana haki ya nani wrong number. Hawa ndio wachukui kura walaka. Wewe nini mnavaa kwa kichwa hii? Good village. Good brother. Ndika wale ngi. Wewe aboki hii tu ya aboki. Hey. Kucha unaita nani aboki? Aboki. Na unajua hiyo jina aboki? Ni jina ama ukipenda kabisa ni ya Nigeria but hao wana pronounce vibaya aboki aboki la maliza <laughs> wenye wala kazi mnaita jump 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 frog jump wakaanza kuteswa Mazee waliteswa. Waliteswa. Ha, walikuja nyumbani wakiwa wamechoka sana wanashindwa wenyewe. Kwani huku kijijini watu si wazuri? Mazee wanateswa. Hayo ni bishi boy. Walikuwa la kofia wamenyang'anywa. Mazee ni ushago ya aina gani? Meme meme meme. We are going to the market. Mm. And some boys stopped us. They asked us to come. Three, three boys. Three, three boys. And they, they collected our, our cabs and they, and they started punishing us. For what one? Yeah. Stop off my hand and run the book. What are the hours? Vijala, 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 Watatu Wame tukulia kofi yake nana wakati wabia tu frog jump Kwa li nusha kwa ya ilagali They are brothers Churu, 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 kango tibu no naga Hapo rona aboki, umeko aboki Unaita hao aboki Wenye wako Aboki na manisha watu wabaya wala kazi ya kufanya Wengu runu Iyo ni nasima mungeteswa Understand what you're talking about Juu hao, hawako wanajua luga ya ki Nigeria, ki Dani Kwa sababu hao ni watoka taoni Yes, yes Eee so when all these things were happening, can you hold me? What did you, you people do? <laughs> they were beating us. They, 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 they asked us to. Uh, they were just asking. Kwani wali sema tu mo dance. Open on top of the beating. Huh? Eh? Uh, on top of the beating. Wana piga nyi wakia bia nyi ruka ruka eh? Shame to you and your brother Dika. Eh, shame on you. Muna esanya kukubali nyi wana ume wakubu wakuteswa. Ni ngumi ya muna? Bona hamu kukunja ngumi hata nyi nyi mutese yawa. Baba, what is tomotomocho? Tomotomocho ni nini? Tomo, oh, okui wana boko yon, na tomojo. Kuna luga igile, udo unaongea, hawa wa ski, hawa wa juu unasema lini. Eze na chobo da, fiesh mi, na tomojo means fear. What is eze? Kezi fe na na bode eze, ba ande a si borata. Ya watoto wa juu iluga. Eze, hafuro de eze, hawa eze. Sariki. Sariki? Sariki of this kingdom, fiesh mi. Sariki? Yes. Sariki, eh. Wacha hiyo, igwe kiongozi wa iki jiji Ana ni inamishia kwa upande wa mangumi Nini munge chafua au vijana na ninge kuja kuulizwa na igwe Magani, magani Ewa, cham Yes, magani, magani Ilo, you people said magani So I was thinking that uh, you know, they were uh, talking about uh, as a mangala That is a mangala mang Katika luga fulani ya wailewani kabisa Ni pale luga mba wanaongea hao vijana Luga mba baba yao wanaongea haipelekani Munasoma kabisa kitu wabai kumdumoni yangu eh Ndiyo munaelewa kama hamushki Soma ulimi eh My tongue can even solve I will use my tongue to tear them pieces I will tear them pieces I will tear them Watch ayo Mudomo yangu inararuanga hao Ita wararua Mushio kope Mukipata mawe Piga hao Panga kamata hawa Sao vijana wetu Hawa vijana wetu hao ni wa Hawa ni watu wa mungu buwana Hawa si watu wa fujo fujo Hawa si watu wa vita vita Sasa wale shidwe ya iki jiji si mzuri Iki jiji si mzuri So asana nasema Enye si mzuri lakini tunajifunza kutokana na iki jiji Sio tu kila siku Mambo yote itakuwa gatuni nyue
lazima kutatokea na farakano lazima kutokea na okay. vitu mbaya mbaya so na sisi kwa sababu ni wanaume lazima tuvumilie wenyewe yeah. wali decide wali decide wavumilie lazima tuelewe kinachokuwa kizuri ni kigani na kinachokuwa kibaya ni kigani na kinakuja kwa wakati gani wala we bila tu nilikwambia lazima tuendelee kukaa hapa na lazima watu watujue na matatujua kwa mbinu moja tutaanza kuonyesha hawa mami ujicha ngoja uone lazima tuonyeshe hawa mami ujicha si ndio eh haisuru na unajua bado udo hakuwaga na furaha hawa vijana wakivaa hizi nguo za Kiislamu ju bado anasema hapa kwao au ni tradition a christians Okay, tukitoka hapo basi tunaelekea hadi kwenye upande wa Palace. Palace ilikuwa gani yake? Igwe. Igwe ni kama kiongozi wa kijiji. Mfalme wa kijiji. Ambapo kumbe wakati huo kule kijijini kulikuwa kumesemekana njaa uwaga inakuja wakati wa Januari. Na njaa inapokuja Januari, kuna vile uwaga wanaenda kuona mganga ambao hao wameamini sana, hawa wana kijiji. Sana sana Igwe kiongozi wa kijiji. Na sasa representative amekuja kuambia Igwe tumeongea na mganga mganga amesema lazima tumpelekee pesa pamoja na mbuzi na kuku alafu atafanya miujiza zake na njaa itaisha ya Januari sikiza sikiza hapa he got sum of 20000 naira okay the white cock and cola notes representing the market days okay. because are given to us okay and we we have to be fast about to do this in, in just in two days yes 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 mganga anasema anataka hizi vitu in two days tusipopeleka in two days ina maanisha kwamba njaa hata itaendelea zaidi okay. na kwa hivyo mganga anaitisha a he goat yani ndume ambaye ni mbuzi mm. bila shaka anataka eh, kuku nyeupe na anataka kola ya 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 ya, ya ku, kuwakilisha soko ndio chakula itakuwa mingi na watu wataenda sokoni kununua sasa ujue hapa ndio mambo yameharibika. Eh already vijana wameshaamua wataanza kufanya mami ujiza zao kwa sababu wana nguvu fulani. Na siku hiyo Udo naye anaambia watoto wake, "Eh mimi sifurahi nikiona mnavaa hizi nguo." I mean, I have one but of you to stop dressing up like a house man. Yet you are still dressing. You are still wearing it. Here is Ibo land. Here in Ibo land, you need to dress up like Ibo boys. You got that? You know, wear jean trouser. Oh, short, short. Then you put on a nice polo. Hey, lazima mjua bana hapa ni Ibo land. Nini muna vaa kama muna vaa saa kama Osama Bin Laden? Hii ni mbaya hii. Vaeni kama vijana wa mta. Virgins. Oye, ongo jeni, chakule naletua. Can a boy like you say thing like that? Hey, mimi ni tawaletea nguo. No, no. What she told you? Yes. Mwanya chakwalega suru na gasa. Chakwaliti nyo gulehiti umuno umu. How can I run away from that place? I came here because of my father's sickness. I was going around and I'm no good. And I'm going to bone to bone. Huh? But I'm going to put that. Walipo chimba zaidi kutakujua ni kwa nini mzee aliweza kutoka kule taoni akakuja hapa ushago <laughs> inasemekana kwamba alifukuzagwa kwa sababu ya kupeala ujamzito yeye yeah, alisema hapana alikuja kwa sababu babake alikuwa gamgonjwa basi sasa si chakula liletwa hebu cheki 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 watoto wana miujiza wakafuruta chakula ikaenda karibu na baba yao hata mzee akafuruta Alafu kidogo hivi chiki 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 chiki. Hussein alifanya nini? Hasan. Chiki ni chakula nenda juu. Haya ya 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 ya. Watu wanakipia bwana wake wakatoka piwa wake na wanda. Hawaja waiona hiyo. Hawaja. Sasa sasa ni wakati wa kuonyesha watu vichanga. Umetuchukulia rais rais. Umetuchukulia rais rais. Leo ni leo. Leo ni leo. Watoto sasa walaanza kazi. Kwanza ulitoroka unatudanganya ati ulitoroka ulikuja nyumbani kuona baba yako mgonjwa. Kumbe wao wanajua baba yao ni ujamzito hiyo yao ilifanya baba katoroka. Sasa ni watainamisha. <laughs> eh hey, inaitwa Esau and Jacob bado maneno. Eh hapo sasa. Kama hano. Ambisho na Moses. Moses. Pas kumbe na 
wakati hiyo ilipofika kesho endi wakati dad ameondoka akaenda tauni akanunua nguo zile nguo ambazo amenunua sasa amenunua jeans pamoja na t-shirt anakuja kuwarazimisha wale watoto kuvaa hizi nguo mnavaa za Kiislamu hapa ni ushago sisi hatuko mambo ya Uislamu lazima mtachange ita ndugu yako hapa come 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 on come on Eh, papa unasemaje? Asante. Eh, sana mke huko. Um, atoromo ifi ya ne menena. Una nene manya, acho mko kusetata. Na magote nleku, ya onu ne mege di nuna, ya kusetata. Are you with me? Oh, oh, oh. I forgot to tell you people are not conversant with you. my dialect. Eh, uh, what I'm trying to say is that I don't want both of you to keep on kitting like in dugu. <laughs> From today, stop wearing this kind of clothes. Bash. Why? I'm not. I'm not comfortable with it. Yes. Kutoka leo. Kutoka leo. Na isikuwa tu ni leo tu. Nikila siku. Staki kwa wana muna vaa hizi ngo tena. Chikuwa yu. Yu ni t-shirt. Eh. Na hii yako. Eh. Na hii. Bash. Maka. Muna vaa kama watoto wakijiji. Muna vaa hizi ngo refurefu inastua watu. Eh, uh, na hapa hakuna uislamu. Harume, mbaro ageme umbune ira kwa. Mbe nisikia. Mbae rakana manda mbara ene la kwa. Ele kwa kwa ele ba la gile. Efi tirienu. Ezi gilili. But what I want both of you to understand. La sima mwelewe. Stop from today. Stop wearing these abokis kulutu. You are Igbo boys. You are Igbo boys. Eh, Igbo boys. Mbavuro yo sala. Soso kwa mwaye na sama alacha. Na basi unajua hii si vizuri hii ni kama unachange mtu kutoka kwa kanisa furani aende kanisa furani kwa razima Ok Sasa muna tu change eh. Muzee aujasoma kwa miujisa tulikuonyesha jana eh. Na unatuambia tuvai hii eh. Na amesema ni kitoka inje ni kuta mumesha vai zonguo eh? eh. Uyu muzee wa isi soma uyu Uyu muzee We sasa wacha tujue. Kila siku si wanapikaga sukuma wiki hapa eh lazima tulete nyama leo. Sawa tu tutavaa vile dada anasema lakini eh tutajua. Alafu ndugu mpenzi mtazamaji tunarudi hadi upande wa kule mshtuni. Ah sehemu ambako uwaga ndio territory ya yule mganga ambaye mganga mwenyewe alikuwa ameitisha ame, ame mbuzi akaitisha jogoo nyeupe na akaitisha 20000 naira. Na zile pesa pamoja na mbuzi na ile kuku haikuwa iletwe ipewe yeye live live ilikuwa iletwe iwekwe kwenye hiyo compound ya huyu mganga mganga tu akuja kutane nazo Alafu cha maajabu mganga alipofika hapa akakuta ile vitu aliitisha hakuna alishtuka hakuna mbuzi hakuna kuku hakuna pesa chine kemeo Hakuna mbuzi, hakuna kuku, hakuna pesa. Na hiyo ndio vitu ilikuwa inatumika kuja kuombewa kiuganga kale ya kufukuza njaa. Ati ndio hii Januari, ikuwe ya si Januari, ikuwe ni Februari. Ati sasa ndio njaa imalizike kijijini. Wacha mganga alete shida. Mganga alileta shida. Hata ajui nani alichukua mbuzi nani alichukua kuku. Hai alafu sasa sasa ndio tujue. Eh e, Udo anaitisha chakula wamekuwa na njaa. Ile chakula ililetwa na ni mama ameleta sasa ana bibi yake Udo. Kufunua angalie ni chakula gani imeletwa. Umetoa wapi kuku? Umetoa wapi kuku? I reserve some for soup and stew. Ulisa vijana yako. Hao ndio wamekuja la kuku na wakakuja la mbusi. Na imechinjwa sote. <laughs> Wamechinja wote wakatupa matumbo. So wamele. Okay, vijana wangu, kumbe nyinyi ni watu wazuri. Nyinyi ni watu wazuri sana. Muendeleke hivyo hivyo. Fanyeni kazi, toeni jasho, leta chakula nyumbani. Wacha hiyo. Dad unasema tu ati hiyo chakula eh? Tuko na vitu mingi. <laughs> Baba, sorry, what uh, Papa, 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 Papa,
Ana ana anasema ajali pale mmetoa hiyo mbuzi pale mmetoa kuku mimi sijali eh bora mmeileta sisi tutakula tu Big to call my hard working boys These are my hard working boys Imagine hawajui hawe udo kuliko ulizi mmetoa wapi ah ah ati ni hard working boys Ash papa wacha hata hivyo hata pesa tuko nayo Ati Papa man is not the problem let me show you Ya angalia pesa ndio hii 20000 Tell me it's a joke. Ini pesa, ini pesa elfu moja moja, ishirini. Hehehe. Kwa tatu, kula tatu, kula tatu, kula tatu. Kula tatu ya kijiji, ya kijiji na kuwaga moja, bili, tatu, na kufunga. You close it. You close it. Moja, bili, tatu. Ona ataka ya ine, ya ine, ya ine. Ya ine, ya ine. Unga. Brother Mpenzi, unapoona watoto wamekuja na kitu kama hii, uliza wametoa wapi? Usifurahie. Uliza wametoa wapi? Kusema kweli, kuna kuku imepotea na kuna mbuzi imepotea wa, ya waganga. Hao wamekuja live. Bash, ripoti kumbe zilifika kwa mfalme wa kijiji ambaye ni yule Igwe ati huu mganga ametuma ripoti kwamba mbuzi pamoja na kuku ambaye tulituma na pesa ziko missing in action. Who is yet to perform the sacrifice when everything has provided got missing? Who oh, may the gods be praised? Mfalme anafurahi. Already accepted the sacrifice already. Ati Mungu amekubali sacrifice kwa sababu hiyo mbuzi imechukuliwa na Mungu. Si Mungu wewe? Si Mungu amechukua hiyo? Hiyo kitu ni kama imeibiwa. Practically and tactically impossible for somebody to get into the shrine and make away with all the items meant for the sacrifice. It's impossible. This is an abomination. Hey. And you know the rest of the gods. But Igwe, if I may suggest, what do we do now? What are we to do, Igwe? Um, only Igwe. replace those items immediately. We must perform that sacrifice. Bash. Sasa ilipindi yenyewe mfalme akapija kumfamisha hapa yenyewe ndio mjakazi wake. Itabidi to replace, itabidi to replace iwekwe mbuzi ingine, kuku ingine ichukuliwe na pesa fulani zingine zichukuliwe. Na kweli zikachukuliwa na zikawekwa mustuni. Tena wale watoto walipokuwa napiga raundi Ujua hao ndio walichukua wali mbuzi ya mganga. Na walikuja mara pili tena wakakuta haya, ndio ipe pesa nyingine tena. Kumbe wakati hiyo mganga alikuwa hapo. Ndio wakati alikuwa anarudi. Na unajua already vijana wanasema la hii mstuni hapa ni mzuri aje. Kila siku tunakuta vitu mzuri. Hapo ndiyo mganga alipo waona Akasema kumbe nyinyi ndiyo mulichukua mbuzi yenye nililetewa hapa Wee nani? Yali ya mwagopi hata kuuliza mimi ni nani? Hawa toto wakona tabi gani? Mwini forest Eee wewe Kumbuni Imagine wanaongelesha wanaongelesha mganga ni kama ndugu ya ni kama ni kama mtoto. Kwa mita tumia uganga yangu akirale kupika waka akashika. Haya. Hiyo uganga wakaishika licha akatupa chini. Kaidish powers. Waliambiwa hiyo pawa yako ni ya ujinga. Unajua sasa hii tunaweza kukuumiza. Unataka tukuumize. Wewe, nyinyi ni wapi? Kiwe in council. Must share this. Lazima Igwe asikia habari hii kwamba kuna watoto wamekuja na ujinga. Oh, we, na Igwe yenyewe akisikia habari yetu hiyo itakuwa inamaanisha tukao tumejulikana. Sasa wewe kwa sababu na mdomo ya kuongea ngoja bwana ngoja. Kupiwa. Ibu chiki. Waliaribu sauti yake mganga. Let us see how you are going to tell them. Eh, enda sasa uambie hao. Na kwanza ile mbusi nyingine yenye waleta tena wakachukua. Wamechukua mbusi nyingine. Na mganga sasa ongei, mganga si ile sauti anatoa. Hebu sikiza. Mganga alikipia kwa na kuambia mfalme. Kumbe
Kumbe katika hali ya kukimbia na mna hiyo. Brother Mpenzi mtazamaji, afadhali tukuje kuelewa katika sehemu ya tatu, sehemu ya nne ya picha Esao and Jacob. Mambo yalikuwa namna gani? Na ukitaka kujua zaidi hivi ndivyo vile ambavyo unaonyeshwa kwa ufupi sehemu ya tatu na ya nne itakavyokuwa. Itakuwa moto ya kuotea mbali bro. Kwa hivyo papa hapa utaipokea hapo tomorrow. Wako studio Fishman kwa sasa sina la ziada. My studio